All right, guys, check it out. Today we are continuing the DVD and Blu-ray hunt at the Dollar Tree. But the one I'm at today is actually everything's a dollar and a Dollar Tree. Because I think that Dollar Tree actually bought everything's a dollar. Because that's what these used to all be called. Let's go on in here, see what we can find, guys. Oops, excuse me, I'm sorry. Okay, I saw some DVDs right as we walked in the door, but we're gonna look for some other ones because there's some other people up there looking through them right now. Look at this though, holy Joe dirt. Snakes and sparklers. We are totally getting some of these. <laughs> Kicking wing would be proud. Let's just take a peek over here and see what else cool that they might have while we're waiting for the uh, the DVD aisle to clear up. Here's all our um, glow sticks again. Like I've been seeing these in a lot of the Dollar Trees. And I think the reason these are all out now is because of the 4th of July, although nobody's really having 4th of July unless you get your own snakes and sparklers. <laughs> Look at this, guys. I think these are giant... Is it a, oh, it's a water squirter. I thought these were those big uh, bubble ones. Okay, so you pull it like this and it sucks up the water, you squeeze it back out and it shoots the water out the tip. They always have tons of awesome little toys in here, even though they're not really the greatest quality. They're fun little things for kids. What the heck? Diving octopus. <laughs> those look like the ghosts from, uh, what do you call it, Pac-Man. But yeah, look at this. They have a huge toy aisle. And I'm actually going to bring my granddaughter in here for her birthday and just give her a basket and be like, fill it up, buy anything you want. You know, because everything in here is a dollar. So, I mean, I, uh, I suppose she could fill a basket with like $200 worth of stuff. <laughs> I hope not, but oh well, whatever. Look, they got Flarp. What is this? Is this? Oh, that's that uh, silly string. What the heck? Poop colored silly string. Okay, spray me with poop. I actually need to get a cart because while I'm in here, I need some stuff to do laundry and a few other things. Actually, a basket will do. Okay. All right, here we go. Let's check out these movies. Okay, here's their DVDs, and it basically looks like the same as they have everywhere. Ooh, there's that Belko. Yeah, I don't think I want that. I've seen it a couple times, but in darkness. I don't think I've seen that one anywhere. Uh, wait, what's that? There's that 300 Rise of the Empire. They do have a couple more that other places didn't have. What I'm interested in, though, is the Blu-rays, so let's check those out. I bet you anything it's going to be mostly what we've seen anywhere else. This just looks weird. I mean, this guy is hilarious, so is that guy. So I bet this is probably a pretty funny movie, but I'm just not going to spend the money on it. Josh Harnett, The Lovers. Hmm... I like Josh Harnett, but nah. Ghost at the Gate. Playback. Water Diviner. Oxford Murders. Shock and Awe. Um, this is a Rob Reiner movie, and I've seen it in other stores. These are all excellent actors. Woody Harrelson, Rob Reiner, James Marsden, and Tommy Lee Jones. I cannot believe this wouldn't be a good movie um, but I'm still gonna pass on it I'm just I'm looking for specific ones that I haven't seen anywhere else Big Bad Wolves American Violence hmm Bruce Dern is in this I haven't seen this one anywhere else keep that on the down low there let's see Mandrill Never heard of that one, or the guy that's in it. Hobo with a shotgun. There's all these Assassin's Creed again, oh my gosh. Alright, let's keep on looking here. Hey, Robocop. Cool. I think that's the new one, but I think I'll get that. Journey to Space. Oh. 
Okay, that's more of like a documentary type thing. Keep on looking, Assassin's Creed, blah, blah, blah. Do we have anything that is not Assassin's Creed? Oh my gosh. Don't tell me all the rest of these. Legend of the Warrior. They're all Assassin's Creed, guys. Holy crap. I can't believe that. These two, though, I have not seen anywhere else. I think I'm going to get Robocop, but not American Violence. It's probably pretty good, but... Yeah, I'll leave that one here. Robocop it is. Look at this. Pugs and kisses. <laughs> Alright, just in case, let's head over here. Look down a couple of these other aisles, because you never know, they might still have some more. Probably not. They probably just got them all up there at the front, but you never know. Look at these mini Barbasol cans. I mean, honestly, I think that it's a dollar for one twice the size over at Walmart, so that's not really that great of a deal. Alright, let's see. See, I, need, I do need some kind of baskets like this for the RV, but... You know, I've said before, I have to measure everything first. I can't just go buying stuff. So, no DVDs here. Although, if you have kids, this is cool. Shimmer and Shine shampoo. There's the uh, the pups, the Paw Patrol. That's pretty cool. Look, it's a Mickey bath bomb. Bath bombs are awesome. I've never used them. <laughs> Oh my gosh, they also have hair gunk, hair gel. If I had hair, I would use it. Check this out, guys. A glowing beach ball. That's cool. You put the glow stick in the middle of the beach ball. Oh, check this out. It's like a, a Dennis the Menace slingshot. Only you, you soak that in water and you shoot it at somebody's face. <laughs> Here's extra shot so you could totally load up. Shoot multiple people in the face. All right, let's continue down this aisle. A lot of times you'll find DVDs in the aisle with this kind of stuff, hardware or whatever you want to call it. But I am not seeing any. Again, I think they're all up at the front. Ooh, look at this, a foldable fan. I gotta check this out. <laughs> Ooh, it works, although it kind of stinks. Not today, stinky fan, not today. Oh, sweet, look, wait, first they have puffy stickers and they're turtles. I love puffy stickers. Airplanes, and look, we got 150 Jurassic Park. Well, Jurassic World, but it's Jurassic Park. Gotta love Jurassic Park, it's very Jurassic. There's something else I need in here and I cannot think for the life of me what it would be. I got my fabric softener. Hmm. I do need gloves for emptying the tanks on the RV, but I really don't think I want to be wearing pink gloves. I'll gladly wear a pink shirt any day of the week, but pink gloves, I don't think so. Oh, here's pool noodles. Lots of cool stuff you can do with those. What else do we have here? Ooh, gliders. I think I actually have still an enormous glider at home made of foam that I never opened. I bought it like two years ago. I think I bought like five of them to make a sweet video, and I just never made it. What the heck is this? A noodle booster. Okay. Hmm. We'll leave that there. All right. I think that's it, guys. I'm not seeing anything else that's totally awesome in here. So let's roll out and find another Dollar Tree for some movies.